Hey guys, how's it going? I like to mow here. Um, we're just uh, out here doing some stuff. Uh, I got the, or I used the turf tracer today. I drove it across the neighborhood and uh, to one of my yards. I've showed you in previous videos. Um, and I mowed it. Uh, it took me 15 minutes to do the entire yard versus like 45 minutes to do in my 21 inch back there. So. I'm very satisfied with this. Um, I will be doing a full review of it and the features, going over it, giving me, you mind an honest review of it uh, once I have run it for a while yet. Um, so I'll probably do that in another month or two uh, once I start using it full time for all my yards. Um, so far the sulky is doing good here. Um, as you can see it's got some grass on it. And the tread is starting to get worn down just a tad, but otherwise, I like it. Um, definitely going to take some gain use to the for backing up and that sort of thing. Um, but otherwise, I, I really like it. Um, I am going to be ordering some parts for the mower here. Um, I have to place an order on eBay. I'm going to get an hour meter for it uh, to mount like up here or something. Um, I'm going to get a new air filter cover because this one's cracked as you can see. I'm also going to do the valve cover gaskets. Um, I'm going to grab my phone here and uh, use the flashlight on it to show you. The valve cover gaskets are leaking. Whoops. As you can see on the uh, muffler guard there. Um, they're leaking. Um, it needs to be done on both of them. That one's not as bad as this one, but still needs to be done, so I'm going to uh, change those out. Do a how-to video on that, because I'm sure a lot of you might need help with that. Um, yeah, so far it's working really nicely. I'm very satisfied with my purchase here. Um, and I'm going to pull it out here and uh, grease it up and scrape the deck out. I noticed there was some buildup under it, um, and I'm going to use my new jack stands I got at Harbor Freight. I didn't show you guys that stuff yet today. Whoops. Uh, I went to Harbor Freight and had to, I was originally just going to buy jack stands, and I needed a pack of, um, a new box of uh, the gloves that I use for working on small engines. Um, but I had a coupon for free gloves, so got a free pair of work gloves. Um, and I went and got my jack stand so I can sharpen the blades on this here. Um, and also, I was waiting to check out, and I saw these this set tire repair kit here. Uh, so I got this because those are tubeless tires on there, and they're starting to wear. They're worn out, and they need to be replaced, but I'm going to wait until I use it for a little bit yet and wear those out some more. But um, I got this just in case I need it. Um, if you guys watch Top Notch Lawns, he used a similar set like this to fix the tire on his uh, 48 Vantage. Um, and as you can see, this tire's already been patched. Here's a one of those things. The other tire's been patched as well. Let's see if it. Yeah, right down there. Um, so, yeah, I just got that in case I needed it because um, you guys want to be prepared. Now it's got a ratchet strap for uh, tying down my mower here when I get my trailer, which hopefully is in the next couple weeks. Obviously, I need to clean out my garage a bit here. Um, but I'm going to hopefully get a trailer in the next couple weeks. It's going to be a 5x8 uh, single axle uh, triple crown trailer. I'm trying to decide whether I'm going to get the uh, two foot mesh sides on it or just get the regular short sides. I'm leaning towards the two foot mesh sides because then I can have more space to haul mulch with and keep my equipment in the trailer because I'm not getting racks for it just yet. Um, since I purchased this, I won't be able to shell out another $300, $400 for trimmer racks um, and blower racks. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and back this out, uh, clean it up, sharpen the blades if they need it. I don't think they need it yet, though. Um, so anyways, here we go.
Okay, so we just got that backed out. I'm gonna go ahead and do an unboxing of these uh, jack stands here. See if I can pick it up with one hand. And let's go find a knife. Okay, here's my utility knife. Got the uh, bright green one, so I can't lose it because obviously it's pretty bright and not gonna be lost. Well, cut this open. Were twenty five dollars for this set, so wasn't too bad of a price. Oh, it's just one. Oh no, it's two in there. They're just stacked on top of each other. So there's the manual. I'll page through that in a second. So there's the first part or the stand part. Here's the second one. Here's the actual stand. And that one, or that cardboard. There's the second one. So, see these are ratchet type. So we'll, that one's already opened. There we go. We'll put those in there.